Hello everyone! Welcome back to our online classroom. Today, I will discuss to you all about the order of operations. Specifically, we are going to use the rules in PEMDAS or we need to follow the rules in PEMDAS. Pero bago yan, I advise you na panoorin muna yung uh, video tutorial natin doon sa operation on integers. Dapat master nyo muna paano mag-add, mag-multiply, mag-divide, at mag-subtract ng integers. Kasi importante yan siya dito. Now, let's proceed. So, P stands for the parenthesis, E for the exponent, M for the multiplication, B for division, A for addition, S for subtraction. Yan. So, we are going to use this or we need to follow this rules ng PEMDAS. Now, let's proceed to trending math question. This will be the number one example natin. So, 6 divided by 2, open close parenthesis, 1 plus 2. May papakita ko sa inyo na dalawang solution, titingnan natin dito kung saan ba ang tamang sagot. Then after that, I will explain to you ano ba talaga yung PEMDAS. Next, solution number 1, 6 divided by 2, open and close parenthesis, 1 plus 2, uunahin talaga natin is parenthesis. So, 1 plus 2, kaya nagiging 3 dito. After that, 6 divided by 2 times 3. So, sabi multiplication daw. So, 2 times 3 daw ang ginawa niya dito. So, 2 times 3, kaya nagiging 6. After that, 6 divided by 6, kaya nagiging 1. So, solution number 2 natin. 6 divided by 2, open and close parenthesis, 1 plus 2. Ganun pa rin, parenthesis pa rin yung unahin natin na sa loob ng parenthesis. 1 plus 2, kaya nagiging 3 ang sagot. After that, ang ginawa niya dito is 6 divided by, 6 divided by 2 bago mag times 3. So, 6 divided by 2, kaya nagiging 3 times 3, yung last natin, kaya nagiging 9. Saan ba dyan ang tama at mali? Ang tamang sagot ay 9. Bakit 9? Ngayon, i-discuss natin yung PEMDAS. Ang PEMDAS, or P muna tayo, parenthesis, kung may parenthesis doon sa problem, siya ang uunahin. After that, next natin is kung may exponent na susunod, exponent ang susunod. Next, pagdating sa multiplication sa sa division, magka-level lang yan silang dalawa. Tandaan, magka-level lang yung multiplication sa division. Nakadepende siya kung sino yung nauna from left to right. From left to right, tandaan na kung napapansin nyo dito, nauna si division. Kaya siya yung uunahin bago mag-multiply. Okay, Kung nauna naman si multiplication dito, siya naman ang uunahin. Tandaan natin, magka-level lang si multiplication sa kasi division. Next, pagdating naman sa addition sa sa subtraction, nak nakadepende din kung sino yung nauna. For example, 6 minus 2 plus 3. So, kay nauna man si uh, subtraction, siya yung uunahin bago mag-add. So, yun yung rule natin dito. Tandaan nyo lang sa MD tsaka sa AS. So, kasi yun yung misconception natin dati pa lang. Nasusundin talaga natin kailangan M sunod mauna, mauna bago ang division or addition muna bago subtraction. Hindi. Next, number 2 example natin. So, number 2 example natin, dito napapansin ninyo na may parenthesis na may braces pa sa labas. So, ngayon, Dito, hindi muna na i-add natin, tapos si ma-minus, hindi. Big sabihin nito, kung sino yung pinakaloob talaga ng parenthesis, siya muna yung uunahin. So, solution, ito. Ngayon, dito sa parenthesis na to, meron tayong exponent na, na, na nasa 2. So, 2 raised to 3, siya yung, kaya siya yung uunahin natin. So, 2 raised to 3, kaya nagiging 8 ang sagot. After that, i-bring down natin, sinag uh, divide 2. After that, yeah, i-bring down din natin yung mga numbers na nandito. Hindi muna natin yun siya isi-simplify. After that, yung nasa loob na parenthesis, sila muna yung isi-simplify natin. So, 8 divided by 2, kaya nagiging positive 4 ang sagot. Then, bring down ulit yung mga numbers na nasa gilid niya. Next, after that, may braces pa tayo, may parenthesis pa dito. Ngayon, or multiplication. So, bago tayo mag-subtract, mag-multiply muna tayo dito. Multiplication muna tayo bago mag-subtract. Uh, mag so, 4 times 4, kaya nagiging 16. So, ito na siya. 
7 minus 16 na ang susunod natin. So, 7 minus 16, magiging negative 9 ang sagot. After that, yung negative 9 na to, 4 plus 3 times negative 9, magmumultiply muna tayo bago mag-add. So, 3 times negative 9, that is negative 27. Ngayon, meron na lang tayo na 4 minus 27. So, 4 minus 27, that is negative 23. So, ganyan lang. Next, number 3. 7 plus 3 times 2 divided by 6 plus 12 times 9 plus 2 raised to 3. This will be the solution. Ayan, kung napapansin ninyo, sinisimplify ko na kaagad yung mga pwede nang isimplify. So, dito, I will uh, bring down ko si 7 plus 3 times 2 divided by 6. Kung napapansin ninyo, nauna si multiplication bago kay division. So, siya yung imomultiply muna bago mag-divide. So, 3 times 2, kaya nagiging 6, bring down, divided by 6, plus, pwede ko nang imultiply itong dalawa na to. 12 times 9, that is 108, plus 2 raised to 3, that is equal to 8, kasi 2 times 2 times 2. Kaya nagiging 8 ang sagot natin. Next, after that, dito, kung napapansin ninyo, meron pa tayong division na nasa gitna, i-copy ko muna yung 7, tapos 6 divided by 6, kaya nagiging 1. After that, pwede ko naman ding itong i-add yung nasa dulo. So, 116. So, i-add natin ito lahat-lahat, that is equal to 124. Next, for number 4, example natin. Ito, meron tayong negative 4, open close parenthesis, 2 raised to 3 divided by 2 raised to 2, divided by 8 minus 6 plus 2. This will be the solution. Ayan, so the, sa numerator, isosolve natin yung nasa parenthesis muna. So, meron tayong exponent, kaya 2 raised to 3, kaya nagiging 8 dito, 2 times 2 times 2 yan. Next, divided by 2, open close parenthesis, raised to 2. After that, yung nasa ilalim, dito, 8 minus 6 plus 2 sa denominator natin, napapansin ninyo na una ang subtraction compared kay addition. Kaya, 8 minus 6 muna bago mag plus 2. So, 8 minus 6, 2 plus 2. Next, after that, dito na tayo sa next natin. So, 8 divided by 2 muna, kaya nagiging 4 raised to 2. Tapos, multiply mo natin mamaya sa negative 4. 2 plus 2 sa denominator natin, kaya nagiging 4. After that, Yung exponent na, 4 raised to 2, kaya nagiging 16, just copy negative 4 and bring down 4 dito sa ilalim. After that, negative 4 times 16, kaya nagiging negative 64. So, negative 64 divided by 4, kaya nagiging 16 or negative 16. So, I hope marami kayong natutunan. Yan lang po at God bless everyone.